how to use insta builder plugin to create web pages in this tutorial i'll be teaching you how to use amazing wordpress plugin to create your story page your squeeze page sales page and advertorials but um for the first stage of the tutorial we will not be talking about advertorials i will just talk about the ritual meaning and we again will proceed so other ones we are going to get into other ones now first thing to do is to download insta builder in zip format install insta builder from your cpanel or from your wordpress plugin installation page then you launch the insta builder and start using it it's as easy as that so let's proceed and go straight let's get started immediately so as you can see i'm going to a new domain i'm going to type the domain name so um i'm going to log in straight to the cpanel account okay so i have logged into the cpanel account the first thing for to for you to do is for you to create a page yes but before now remember you must have installed insta builder and for you to install insta builder is very simple uh i'll give i'll give insta builder on the i'll give you insta builder free at the below this video you can check it or you can communicate me if you have not gotten your own insta builder uh, for those who have not gotten it so i can give them free insta builder is is, uh, is a sold plugin i think about 200 dollars or so online but i'm giving you giving uh, the insta builder uh, to you free of charge so what you need to do is uh for install insta builder if i have not installed it if you check here you can see insta builder 2.0 here means i have installed it but if i have not installed it there is nothing just click on come to this page you see plugin you locate okay plugin then you click on add new plugin once you click on add new plugin it will load and um it will take you to this place so you are going to come down and you will click on this one you see upload plugin you will click on it then once you click on upload plugin it will load you to a place where you need to upload you understand what i mean so then you will now choose on choose the particular plugin you want to upload so but because i have already installed insta builder plugin there is no need of choosing uh, this stage again alternative way of doing this is for you to use your cpanel now using your cpanel is very simple type your um your domain name slash cpanel as simple as that slash cpanel so it will log you in directly so once you log in okay let's wait there so you can be able to log into the cpanel it's also very easy i'm talking on how to install insta builder in case if you are finding it difficult difficult installing it now once i've logged into the cpanel i should look at file manager we are seeing file manager you must see it in your own cpanel just locate file manager once you've located file manager okay you come to this uh, left hand side of the page and locate public html you click on public html once it's once it loads then you will see wp content click on wp content then once it loads then come to this place you are seeing and click on plugin can you see plugin tap on tap on it once you tap on the plugin you will then look up you can see upload here upload i see upload you click on upload then it will load once you load you now see select once i click on this select it's going to take me directly to where i need to upload something so me i have to look for uh where i call where i can locate insta builder okay are you with me good i have to locate insta builder here i look for where insta builder are located so you can see insta builder 2.0 right from this place so because i've already installed it there is no need of actually installing it again so once i click on it right now it will load and once it loads then i'll it will show here completed then i have to go back to that page again go back to this place then i will under plugin i will see it here all this place you are seeing this 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 i will now see insta builder 2.0 there so the only thing i need to do is that i will just unzip it I will unzip it then delete the zip folder and leave the folder there are you with me so once i unzip it 
the folder will be remaining and I'll delete the uh, zip folder it's as as easy as that so with that i've already installed instabuilder or you can follow the other process i just showed you using your, your wordpress you can just follow the process it's as easy as that so you can use your wordpress for, uh, with your wordpress and also install instabuilder so we, we just click on upload from here it will show you the place you need to watch uh install you just it will take you to a place where you will select it so once you've installed it after the installation after uploading it from this place if you are using wordpress to upload then the only thing you need to do is for you to activate it uh you show you installation completed you then click on activate after successful activation you will see insta builder here once that is done you head over to create a page you click on pages or pages you click on add new page then it should load okay let's wait for that to load good we want to add a new page so what do you do you click on add new add new here you seeing it good once you click on add new you should load a page where you can add a new page now this place you say add new page what is a page i believe you know what is a page well, a page uh, a website comprised of multiple pages are you with me so it can be from one page ranging to or any number of pages so we are not creating a blog we are creating a page remember our our passion here insta builder is of creating a squeeze page sales page story page advertorial pages and the rest of that so but our our passion is actually on sales page and advertorial page because currently now uh story page is no longer in vogue so advertoria is more in vogue it's just the current selling strategy that works very well so once this have load to this place say add title the title you are adding is actually your page url like slash let's say my page uh the website name there is the domain name is gift gift.com it will not be gift.com slash what am I, i'm going to type now so i can use this i can just uh, use um uh a, a training let me use the word training training only are you following or oh, training one let me use the word training one and i click here to publish the training one meaning that once i publish it this training one has is going live good you can see it published training one is live can you see it here it's actually live so i'll come back to all pages i'll click on all pages then once it loads I will locate the training one I just created. As simple as that. I will look for training one. Uh, training one. Let's check it out. So I think this one is who I will click on this place. We are looking for training one. Training one. Training one. Okay. You can see training one right here. I will click on training one. Once I click on this, this training one, this is just the page I just created right now. For the purpose of this training i call it training one is as easy as that once training one loads okay from there we'll proceed let's allow it to load so as i was saying insta builder is a very powerful software it's a very powerful plugin i mean to say that helps you to create uh, they have already made templates Similar to Elemental, but uh, Elemental is cool in its own unique way. But Insta Builder is more easier to use uh, to create your page. So from here, you come to the once you have loaded, you will now come to the right hand side of this button and scroll down. You scroll down. Um, do you want the discussion comment? You can just leave it on default. Everything as default. Uh, set if image default. Everything that way. If you want to change anything, you can see change it just navigate to this page attributes you can change anything you want to change but the most important thing is that you must click on this insta builder and on it switch it on once you have on it it will show green good can you see it? then it's on now you scroll down and click on launch ib 2.0 editor once you click on that this page will be shown to you now why this page this page is showing you what you want to create. I say Insta Builder is a, a, a mini template. It comes with templates. You can see 
are you interested in sales page in squeeze pages in launch page in webinar page in coming soon page here you can see sub of the page sub category of those pages and the rest of that now but if you are actually going to create what we call advertoria now before i go on what is advertoria advertoria is very simple it's called it's coined from the uh, from two words one advert and editorial now what is advert now advertoria for example in the past if you've run, been running an advert since 2012 to 2016 uh currently in nigeria you see many people use facebook to promote their offer they use Facebook uh different kind of Facebook ad conversion ad traffic ad that is ad, ad objective I'm talking about traffic ad video ad, a different kind of Facebook ad objective to promote the ad but later lately in 2016 Facebook changed their policy and they became tougher to use meaning that you cannot actually use Facebook to promote your um your millionaire makeup product what do I call millionaire makeup products Millionaire makeup products are products that will make you money very fast. For example, if you are selling adult products, you are a dropshipper or you are a digital marketer, you sell anything that has to do with adult products or anything that has to do with trading online, anything that has to do with that looks like hype, make money products as a, as a, as a digital marketer, adult products as a dropshipper or an e-commerce owner, or you sell uh, even some health products that I have to show before and after like facebook will actually ban your account it was it became tougher and very tougher in 2017 to 2018 facebook banned a lot of accounts they are banning they don't even consider sometimes you might be having thousands of dollars in your account right in there because people have gained, Facebook have actually gained the worth of people in the time past, like 2013, 14, 15. So uh, that was when uh, the friend Facebook campaign um, we actually invoked. A lot of changes were made, and Facebook began to ban people's account anyhow. And that made Facebook uh, not actually the best place to run advert again. So from there, many people began to search for alternative ways of running ad. So you can actually use advertoria to run a powerful ad from face with Facebook, but notwithstanding, uh, Facebook is not actually the best place to run advert. To run with adverts right now the best place is what what we call traffic ad traff i call it um viral traffic engine viral traffic engine because it's one is the cheapest source of traffic you can ever get anywhere in the world is the fastest and it gives you access to millions of traffic with it very cheap or very uh uh cheap amount as low as five dollars you can get started or even less than that and get thousands of traffic okay now that is a viral traffic engine but nevertheless remember our intention is to define the word advertoria advertoria i say you come from the word advert and editoria advert means that you are unlike that former time i was talking about people use what we call story page and video page to, to run an advert they create a story a tell a story of something and use see you this insta builder come and pick up a this once you click on this place you can see where i call um squeeze page then can you squeeze page and create up a story and do what and run your ad because people get to uh uh, uh, people are more captured by story but you see in the long in the long run a lot of people a lot of uh, potential buyers start losing interest with main stories the reason is because one of the things that will make your buyer to buy your product one of the reasons you have to capture the mind of your buyer you have to hold your buyer hold hold him or her very well that you have to compare him or her to buy your product is what when you can be able to gain the person's trust trust is actually the reason why you buy my products or someone buy your products because the person trusts you why is it that amazon will be selling for dropshippers if you if you like myself i have a store in amazon but if you don't have a store in amazon have you ever wondered why sometimes amazon will be selling a product for 50 dollars and you will be selling it in your own uh, store for let's say $30 and people will say head over to Amazon and buy it. 
the reason is because they believe that that $50, they were not going to lose their money. They have great, they have developed a high level of trust with Amazon. They know that once they, uh, they pay that money to Amazon, that their goods will be sent to them anywhere they are in the US. They, uh, anywhere they are in the world, they are getting their goods. But for you, as an individual owner of a store, they are not sure of that. They might be scared that you might be, a, oh, this one, this product might not be strong. Even when they have developed trust, the fact that you are not a scammer, you are for real, you are sending them their products, but they don't trust the quality of a product and rest of that. So when customers don't trust you, they don't buy more from you. So the purpose of Advertoria is to create trust. Trust. That is number one purpose is to make your customers to trust you that first, once they see your advert, they are they, they are going to develop a high a high rate of trust. So with uh professionals professionally and also uh with experience, I can tell you that about 85% trust is being developed with uh advertoria more than every other means of what running your ad okay now because advertoria comes in a newspaper format with all these newspaper and magazines that have that have gained trust you are also indicating it there so in another training which we are going to do next time in the next webinar that will be coming out very soon uh yes in that webinar i will be teaching you how to the secret of advertoria how to use advertoria for your any kind of offer you want to promote especially i'll be using digital market as a sample to show you powerful advertorias and i'll be giving you advertoria templates that you can use to promote but for now i want to talk about sales page how to create a sales page with all this drag and drop button and using a sales page format i mean a sales page team already built for you with insta builder okay so you can click here on sales page you can see sales page platforms have loaded is an amazing let's check it out you can see this are you can select the one you want to use okay these are all sales page platform but now they will ask you whether you want to use a video sales page you can come here to subtype me i want to choose a either a test or a video sales page let's just check on a video sales page because i always like using a video sales page why i believe that people people trust more video yeah people trust video more or oh, let me use that word good so now you can see this is a video sales page a video sales page i can now click on choose choose now i will choose it then let me choose another one let's check okay let's just choose this one now if you are using if you are uh if it is advertoria you want to edit what do you do you don't choose any of these templates you are going to click on create from scratch you click here create from scratch and follow the instruction i will be giving you on the webinar to create your advertoria but let's let's leave that for the day of the webinar then we'll talk about that and have many other things like affiliate marketing with jvzu warrior plus these are part of the things we will be discussing on the day of the webinar how to uh, start affiliate marketing with jvzu and warrior plus how to run your digital marketing here in nigeria successfully and all that things and how to create your uh how to list your list your um your product or to own a store in amazon and ebay that means you start selling from amazon you become part of the door part of the people selling in amazon and ebay you have a store with them okay la let's leave that for that let's proceed once you have clicked on choose i i actually open a new tab a new link so let's open the link it, it brings you up to this place so this is a drag and drag and drop button as i said earlier this is for logo do you if you have a logo an image logo you must have in, indicated or um you must have designed the logo by now just head over to canva.com use canvas.com and design your logo and uh, you can bring it here now i don't need the logo then i have to delete it i'll click on delete so good i've deleted it but this background uh i can leave this background color or if i want to bring a background image i can click on this place this place, this thing you can see edit configuration then you can see background color if you want to change the background color you can see if you want to make it an, a video you can make it a video then but i need a background image you can see background image here are you seeing background image then i click on background image good once I click on background image, I have to go and bring an image. 
um to put the url of image i'll go back to my site then i'm going to click on media for media i'll click on add new or i think i already have our let me just use an image i already own here so i'll just click on library remember this media i am in media um i think we we'll have to close this part this part of the page okay let's wait for it while it loads okay let's proceed as you can as you can see i click on media for media i click on add new then i'll, I'll let me click on um this is a list of media uh, pictures that i've shown before okay let's just choose one of this picture and um as our background picture okay so let's use one of the picture this is just a sample picture it doesn't mean that it's good for a background but i'm just using it it's just a sample picture we want to use for a background um let's just pick a picture and use let me pick let me pick this um let me pick this so then i copy this Now, this thing I'm using is very simple to use. As one, well, I mean, very simple. I'll copy it. Can you see this copy link? I copy the the link of this image. I ha I have created a new tab where I have my media library, and I open the page. Then I copy the link of that image. Please don't get confused. It's very simple. Are you following? I actually created under this place. What did I do? I have I op this my this is the place I'm creating the site. But remember, I opened the another tab that time that I have the dashboard see open. So I click on media. For media, I click on library or add new images. You upload the image. After uploading the image, you know have because I've already uploaded the image. That's why I have the images that right here. These are images I already uploaded. So that is the image I'm seeing there. So you now come back after copying it. You come back to this place and you paste what you've copied. Once you paste it, it's going to show down here. You click on it. Good. It has shown here. So, but I, I don't really want all this through. So I can drag it. I can make it bolder. I can bring it down. Drag this thing. You can see that it's showing. Are you with me? So it has shown. After the end, I pro let me proceed. Why am I seeing the template like this? Because this is how Insta Builder the template of this one comes. So you can edit it. Don't don't be uh don't shake. You can edit it now. This is also one of the way Advertoria also coin. Okay, let's say this is a local Advertoria for Nigerian. You can see Vanguard News. Now, what happened when people see this Vanguard News? They don't even know that these things are just images. But if you are creating an, your advertoria, it is not advisable that you use image in this platform. You are going to learn how to create all this thing from scratch, learn how to add all these new sports, all this thing you're seeing here. Exactly the site. I can tell you that with advertoria we can duplicate this site exactly the way it is. The only different we, we, uh, we are going to have is just the domain name is that the domain name of the site is different from what we had here so that just will be the only difference we can duplicate the site but if you are a if you want to do it in less than one less than one's way you can just use image just a uh, club an image and use in this platform are you with me so you can now see image then you can see vanguard you are seeing the, the vanguard news i think we have not actually let's let's make it so we can see the news the vanguard news actually so if i drag this thing down you can then see the vanguard you can see what is the news let me share, let me uh can do this in this side if i knew bar how i become a millionaire at 19 is a breaking news i seen it this direct from vanguard okay so then you can then start writing up your 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 your, your either this your advertoria here now in advertoria uh you don't really need video for here but remember we are not creating advertoria what we are creating now is a sales is a sales page right so um 
let us go ahead with our sales page then let's say our sales page here, under here anything all, all these things you can you can edit them you can just click on this test button edit test and you can see the editing them so i can remove this one i'll be like okay let me type watch my video on how oba on how oba became a millionaire at age 19. why am i typing this because i just type this one because that is what my headline is talking about that is my headline here so that is what he's talking about that was why i just typed it that way but it doesn't necessarily mean to be in this format i just type it because it's what my headline is talking about so from there i can proceed and as you're typing you are clicking on this save this save button you are clicking here i click on it so it's save you can see please wait while it's saving it is saved automatically so and um then this video here you can just create a video on youtube uh, to create a video on youtube is pretty very easy what i mean very easy is as easy as anything okay so okay now you must have created a video on youtube to use this one you click on here then you just click on this button here this one edit configuration then this will be the youtube either from youtube or even if you want from youtube you check you select the source whether it's from vimeo if you are using an embedded code you want to host it directly from this place you select but i prefer you use youtube just hold the video on youtube so the video will be hosted free within to host a video on youtube is very pretty easy just create a youtube channel which is very easy and you host, add your video on youtube then after then you copy the link of your video and come and paste it here there is a link of youtube video here which is, which is youtube that the video insta builder is using here they are just using they left that video then let me go to over to my youtube channel and copy a video and one of one of my video and then um i will just put the video here so we can as well use it okay this is a video okay this is one of the video i have on e-commerce so i will copy the video I'll copy either the copy the embedded code i copy the url video url anyone you want to use so once i copy it i will get over to this place i will then remove their own here i will remove their own and paste it then because i've already hosted the video on that place that's why i copied it so if you have not first of all host the video host it on youtube once i've copied it then uh, let me change my title my content again because i have already the video i posted is on youtube on on uh, um it talks about uh what is it called it talks about um my video talks about e-commerce i cannot say watch my video watch my video on e-commerce e-commerce training training for free let me use that word okay can you see it i save immediately then i come down this order button yes i want to order i'm not selling anything in this place in the on this so i can just click remove this one here so yes i want to order i delete it this thing will go automatically so you can see from here i want to edit all these things i don't like this pop-up coming up or this rubbish cam so then i will de delete this one because i don't want it so because i don't want it i will delete it immediately so then i'll here i'm sorry something is interrupting the okay we can anything you want to edit here we'll just double click Let's look at this one i don't want to use this one i can just click on it and delete it or i want to delete if i can delete this whole platform so i'll just click on the whole platform look at it here you can select it i seen it i click on it and come and delete it from here i'll come and delete it from here I'll click ok it will be deleted I don't want this whole platform as well i want to delete it as well i'll click from here then it will be deleted i also don't want this whole one okay let's delete it let's delete this once 
you can click on this place okay it should be deleted i don't want this yes i want to order it's another one different from the one i deleted initially so i'll click on it okay and i'll click on it uh, yes i want to order i will delete it i don't want this one as well i just want to use what i want i don't want what insta builder is giving me to use so i want to include my own so i will as well delete it good then after then let me show you how the tool we are going to use you see all this thing we can use it to create any kind of thing you can see let me explain all of them you can see this one is called talk is y section it talks about section so this second one talk about y section are you with me this one talks about white background boss so i'm sorry for the pop-up that is actually disturbing us uh, with your rubbish you are uh, sending us so um we can see test element you can see test element this title element this test element these images this for video this for boss element this is a uh, divider this is for countdown this is for button element just touch all of the anyone you want you touch you are going to see what the function of that thing is just as, as simple as that and that function is what it actually does but what do i want to do i want to type so the first thing i'm going to include in, to type is i want to have a section so either a white section or just a section so i will use a section i'll drag this section and come to this place are you seeing it and leave it are you seeing the section now the section has been created can you see how this white section then i want to include a test now a title test i'll drag the title test and come and leave it here the title test is here already then i want to type the title because i want i now want to start typing um my my long sales letter remember after your advertoria where which link do you refer people to where do you direct people to you are directing them straight to your sales page so your sales page must be very powerful it must be captivating it must talk about what you are doing it must not it must it must drag buyers it must make them to go insane to want to buy your product by all means so remember what i'm talking about is onwards free e-commerce training i can be like um uh the first the first free ecom training to ever hold in nigeria you can see so it is all for free you know people like free things they want to they want to come and watch probably you want to they want to they want to really know what you have to offer now so i i, I change you can now change this since i have changed the heading to three so let's say i want to leave the heading at two since it's actually heading i want to centralize it i want to centralize this i want to make it bold then what is in do i want do i like the color like this it's black i want to make it red the test color red let's check how red is red okay then is too scattered um the next thing for us to do we can decide to add bullets or not adding bullets okay then i want to remember i want to make it red so after then i want to you can change the font family that is the font size or i want to use you can use the default own you can use anyone you want to use me i prefer i want to use time romanos so or you can use anyone you want to actually use so um that is for that you can use anyone you want to use for here um just check if you're using ms word before this will not be any, anything for you the font family the size you want to uh change the font size you want to use so what do you do 
you can include increase or reduce the font size to use okay i think i want to change the test here so i'll i'll come and highlight it i want to change the test you can say something like this feature watch top glues in the internet marketing world watch okay gideon popular in a show millionaires on victory as they show you nigerian use okay as they show nigerian use proven ways of earning seven figures online doing a legitimate uh, a, doing a pure legitimate business okay then i save remember this this is a sales page this is a sales page are you with me the easiest way of creating it but one thing you must make sure that you, you are doing you are not just creating a page you are not creating a high page anything you are saying you must be very careful you are saying something that is genuine something that is real what because remember i said i told you el el something earlier i said you your advertoria have helped you build confidence and trust in your client in your potential customers so once they come to your sales page anything they are going to see they will believe it but you must make sure that your customers because they have gained your trust i have people in my email in my email list they have been a follower since 2012 what I mean, if you are doing email marketing, they have been in my email list since 2012. Some of them, in that 2012, probably all the campaign I ran, all the email I sent, autoresponder mails I scheduled, I don't, so most of them did not buy. But in the long run, I discovered that almost 100% of those in my email list are converted. I feel like they all bought my product once a time. So, and they keep on buying over and over again. Why? Because when they buy the product, this product actually solves the problem. Like if I said, watch top gurus in the internet marketing world, I mention name and also say, I say, show you proven ways of any seven figures. That means anything I'm going to talk about here must be able to show that proven ways of any that seven figures. I must not just type it because of anything. Anything I'm putting here, it must be true. Many, I am teaching them how to uh, uh, set up a free e-commerce business. Good. Probably I want to teach them how to set up dropshipping business. How to set up, how to run their dropshipping with Amazon. How to set up their, their store with Amazon and the rest of that. So let me include another test button here. I'll drag it and leave it here. So everything I want to do, I'll come and click on the test. And click on this edit everything I want to I'm talking about here must be genuine and it must be real like uh, it must be well real that is what I'm talking about so you can start typing after typing or have typed my, myself sometimes I might prefer to type in MS Word I will just copy it and come and paste it here I have typed my long sex letter this one is not too long enough but it's just for the purpose of this video we have discussed the greatest mystery behind making uh shows up on internet as i recent as i was recently interviewed by vanguard i have clarified the wrong impression many people have about online base and i quoted there are still legitimate ways of making money through the internet not all successful people who uses phones and computers to make money are old boys as most nigerians believe no we still have various ways of making pure money without scamming people today. You will be learned from the horse's mouth himself. So now, this is just a sample of it, of what you you how you how you need to coin your sales letter. But these particular ones, probably you are you are you are running you are selling a dropshipping. Uh, uh, you are a dropshipper. This is not how you need to watch write your word this is more because if you are into digital marketing and probably are selling make money products it's example of it depending on the product you are selling and you need to talk to you must not type my word or go with my word word to word just make sure you are using your word you are using it the you are using something that is real to you something that is very very real you are not, you don't just copy somebody's word and come and paste it no you have to make sure you are using something that is real you are offering something that is genuine you are not deceiving your customers because it's very important once your customers trust you they will buy more products from you and once they discover that you are very real you are genuine whatever you are selling to them is genuine there is nothing as in everything you are talking about is just too genuine they will keep on buying products for you because they have gained your trust i hope me they have gained your trust so it's as simple as that 
okay what i want to do now i don't want to include this video here i want to delete this video in this place so i want to drag the video down then i will move down let's know if the video if we can be able to okay okay let, let me leave the video here i'll drag that video that was up here to this down it's as simple as that because i don't want it to be up again and i will drag this place the video button down as well so i don't want it to be up again i'll drag it here can you see it down there so this place is empty i will now come and delete the place the folder that hold, hold this video i'll come and delete this because it's no longer important to me good it, it disappears so now i will now come down the video is here i can now be like after typing all this letter i can now be like watch this once they finish watching it i can now include an, an a test element down again okay i have to delete this particular test element because it's very close to the video i want to create i will include the y section or a section or rather i will just drag a section and keep here good under that section i can now include a test element under the section can you see it it's as simple as that we have created a section we included the test element then i can now say i can now talk to them i'll be like don't just watch this video start action now by following the okay sorry the step by step what guide already shown in the video watch learn and booked to action good now once i type this thing now just like this i can then i can decide to make it bold i can increase i can use the paragraph three then as well um let's check how it is okay let's just leave it like this for now so from here you can include another test element down again and you keep on typing or you can you can you will be like uh you can decide to add let's let's explore other contents here so you can see how other ones work let me be like i can be like i, I, I can add a, a test uh a title element i'll be like where i am giving you okay i'm giving you a free offer before free offer on affiliate marketing with jvzoo and warrior cross or let me just use jvzoo before the end of this month okay then i'll be like okay i'll be like um click or get in touch with me get in touch with me before the get in touch with me before the moons runs out runs out the countdown okay okay before the countdown ends before the counts now ends do you see that as simple as that you can come to this place make the heading three you can you can make it centralize it make it centralize you can decide to make it bold or you can make your your test red 
or put any color you want to put let's use another color or um, orange which color do we choose now just let's choose another color and see how it looks okay something like this then you can make it bold and look then you save so now you will now have to come and include countdown here are you there yeah you have to come and include countdown button right there now sometimes when you want to save it you might encounter difficulty in saving it okay it is saved now so this is countdown button you cannot include it you now drag it and drop here i see countdown you click on it then you click on this edit configuration then you, you first thing you click on countdown setup then do you want an evergreen countdown or set and date so evergreen means the date will just it will not expire you will just keep on counting people will come and look at that date that date will not expire it will just keep on counting let's say you set it for two days every day you anyone log into your site you should be showing that two days remaining i don't actually like it because it will not help customers to gain trust on they will be like ah this guy this this guy is uh, off and the expire so you must make sure that your offer expires at a particular time when you take customers my offer expires on the 25th of december on the 25th of december make sure it expires then and if customers contact you tell them that this offer has expired and you can no longer get in even if you are selling the products you can no longer get an offer so that is it like that so let's say this will be 12 12 is december 12 and this should be 25th for instance so we have scheduled it for the 25th of december to when so you scroll down here and then you click here time zone which one do you want to use um just explore it you can use i use you can leave it in utc yeah not just you can just leave it in utc after then you save you come back and click here and click on design so on the design you can just explore it do you want to use normal test i like using fancy anyone you can use anyone you can use gloss boss fancy test or anyone you can see the team two days remaining are you following because the thing is actually that 25 I, I i i i indicated is it means the date it will expire from the from the date you are let's say today is 23rd that is why it is showing two days remaining are you with me so meaning that two, two days remaining to 25th that is just what it means so you can see two days remaining it's the countdown will show you once you launch this website and you see this countdown showing then you can edit other ones you can see solid well, the border test you can edit it you can you can change the, uh, the font size and do so many other things there so on the design you can as well come here and take on expiry action and edit it so just maximize uh, screw around it and uh, do more with that so once the countdown is showing um what again do you want to include so we'll explore more option look at everything and um okay let's say i want to add image i can just come and drag and drop this column button i want to add image in column form i will drag and drop it here once i drag and drop the image i seen it i can now drag this image button to the first one you will just see it you enter the column it enters i will drag the second image but i'll click another image button to the second column meaning that i'm not having okay i have not entered you can drag it to this place Oh no once you enter you will see it you can see you have entered now good you can see you have not have two images to this is a placement image placement holder so what i want to add image now what i need to do just i will just click on this configuration i will now see this url so i will now go back to that place to this place where i chose uh, my media where i showed you media before library and pick any image of my choice and copy and paste there are you with me as simple as that but before then before we do that let me quickly add a test button let me add a test button here um let me drag a test button and and put the test button below the image here sorry let's do that again 
okay you no know? once you show this it's not going to add so you must make sure you show something like this here good you can leave it here you can see the test button is below the image but i don't actually appreciate it that way but we can still leave it since we are just so once i add that test button i can right let's now add an image let's add image any image at all we can go back to that place to the library and include an image we want to use so let's say i want to add this image okay this is an one of the, one of my a, a bank statement image in 2018 okay 2019 sorry 2018 to 20, uh, 2019 so i can just copy this now and go back to that place as simple as that and i'll paste it i'll paste the url right there good it shows and then i'll click here then i'll come to this side again and click on configuration and go back to that place then cancel this one check another image of this one this another this for paper check another one then copy it all the same i'm copying it okay copy okay once you copy it you go back and do what you paste are you seeing it do you now have two images so after that time you created another but remember i just did a test here so i now told them you can be calm down with showing say there is no need of being or there is no need to be frustrated anymore grab this life changing opportunity now remember it's for free i can even in, indicate that like grab this okay don't let this pass you by by and finally start seeing the massive profits you have dreamed about this all this all this okay will be handed over to you for free tell me why people will not come if you run if you run a promotion and people from your from your uh, 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 from your page for your advertorial page you are linking them to your sales page and your sales page you're not actually selling a product you're not telling them to come buy any product but you are instead giving them a free offer a free offer it's not like you are promising them that you are going to give them a free offer you can you can see it from the beginning that i've already given them a video teaching them e-commerce for free like for free and they are seeing this free offer and when they come back you are also promising them a webinar for free this is a webinar uh, affiliate marketing webinar uh they have to do with affiliate marketing with jvzu uh warrior plot uh, and the rest of them that i'm also promising them that i'm giving them for free they are learning the uh, uh, the webinar is coming up and it's still for free even if the webinar is not for free just indicate it here that the webinar is not for free so anyone who, so you will not get people who don't really have money or who, who are not interested and they will be showing interest because people like free stuff enough even though free free stuff are not detailed enough so you indicate it so and tell me you are going to have and you included your mobile number or also included your office address you can see it in this is very very important because some people some customers before they buy or those of them is within the state they want to come and visit they want to come and come to your office they want to come to meet you so if you have an office you can include the office address there and include to them that this is your office so in case any of them who want to come around can as well come around and book an appointment with you for either one on one training so let's save this page right now there is no time i want to surround off with this training so and after saving it we are going to preview it good we are done creating our page let's preview what we've done so i'll come over to another page i'll then type the url link or you can even preview directly from here you can preview directly from here so um if, if you don't want to do that you can just type you can say visit page you click on visit page the page is loading so you can see that will be how the page will be is going to show on desktop you can preview it with phone are you seeing it wow this is the page this is how it's showing this is the page we created why is this side showing and this side showing because of that session we created that time yes we created a y session that is the reason why it's showing like that let's scroll down 
we can see this is our sales page this is the video we included in this page if i play the video right now you can see the video let's play the video I want to teach you today okay. how to start and this work is the video. Okay, then you can see the time. I see that the countdown is counting. It's two days remaining, zero hour, 12 minutes. The seconds is counting immediately. So you can see the pictures are included, are there. Everything. So you can explore more on all these things. So you can return back to your YouTube page and edit anything you want to edit. It's as simple as that. So Insta Builder, this plugin is just to, to, uh, easy to use. There is nothing hard for, uh, for uh, using Insta Builder. Just explore all these options I have showed you on Insta Builder. You can just explore how to use them. There is nothing difficult. There is very simple. So, lastly, as I said, this training has taken a lot of time. You can see how many hours or how many minutes we've actually spent. So we've spent time, we spent over 56 minutes. That is really long. So if not, I would have said we are going to um I'm going to teach you how to create advertoria in this training, but that will be another training in the webinar. We're having a webinar coming up on the first of January 2020. So the webinar will be coming up, and the webinar will be talking about uh how to create how to uh start up affiliate marketing with jvzoo with warrior plus and also other other platforms will be teaching you it will be telling you how to what skyrocket and make uh and also how to run a very cheap advert with what viral uh, uh traffic engine and so many things you'll be learning from that and how to pick up a, 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 any offer from jvzoo and promote and get massive income from it so affiliate marketing is actually the way forward for digital marketers and lastly you also be learning how to run a digital marketing here in nigeria how to sell products like for example video video products how to create the videos how to package the videos how to write your sales letter your uh, your advertoria everything you'll be learning it how to follow up your email marketing and also the new marketing that is better than email marketing you're also going to learn all that and lastly we'll also be teaching you on that same uh, uh um seminar on that same video seminar we'll also be teaching you how to uh, list I, I know most of you already own a store in uh, have your personal store a door shipping store or run e-commerce already but we'll be showing you how to list your core or how to own a store in amazon and ebay amazon and ebay this makes you to sell even without running an advert because many people are already buying from amazon and ebay so these are the things you'll be learning from there so hope to see you on that seminar and follow us up either on youtube or hook us up directly with our mobile contacts below so we can get in touch with us on the seminar date so if you are not part of the if you don't have the link to the seminar you can actually get to join the seminar see you